what up? Today, I'm going to share a framework that works for all kinds of creators and businesses. And I call it the dream avatar. I use this framework for the content that I create for this channel and all my short form content on other platforms and for my clothing brand that I ran last year, which I grew to over 200,000 followers on social media. This video will teach you how to develop a connection with your target audience or your target market because in business, in content creation, you need to have that connection with your consumers. So let's get into it. First off, what is it? What is the dream avatar? To put it simply, a dream avatar is a made up character that represents your target audience or target market. It is a single persona that represents a specific person, a group of people, or an entire audience or market. So it's either one of those three. Usually it's just one single persona within your entire consumer based market or audience. Now, why do you need a dream avatar? Well, the answer is simple as well, because you need to know your consumers. We all ask all the important questions like who is in your niche? Who consumes the content within your niche? Who purchases your products? That who is the person you create content or sell to, which is your dream avatar. And this framework lets you know everything about them. What do they like? What do they dislike? Why do they like X? Why do they dislike Y? What makes them laugh? And the most important questions that you need to be asking is, what are their desires? What are their dream outcomes? Which we'll get into later. Basically, what is their dream goal? What is their dream result? What motivates them? What outcome do they want in the end? Once you know all of this, your job is to create a solution out of them. And this solution can be through your content or through your product or your service. Okay, now how do we create a dream avatar? Just a heads up, you're going to be doing a lot of writing. And I'm, I'm saying like a lot. And that's basically all you need to do. You need to think and write. So this is my process of creating a dream avatar. Pay attention. Step one, write a profile list. This includes their age, their gender, ethnicity, habits, hobbies, likes, dislikes, physical looks, personality, beliefs, values, and their health or financial or relationship situations. When you write their profile, it should be very detailed because you want to visualize your target consumer as much as possible. Step two, write a list of dream outcomes. This includes all their goals, all their desires, and all the results that they want in life. Again, be very specific with this. Also, when you write dream outcomes, make sure it's relevant to your business or your content. Otherwise, if it's not, then there's no point in writing them. I write the dream outcomes for all my dream avatars using four categories, lifestyle, health, finance, and relationships. And again, if one of these categories aren't relevant to your business or content, then there's no need to write them or use them. Step three, write a list of problems. In this step, you need to write an entire list of all the problems that they would face along the way of achieving their dream outcomes. So for example, if I wanted a six pack and I'm your dream avatar, you would have to list all of the problems that I would face along the way of training for a six pack or creating a diet for a six pack or the training schedule that I should have for a six pack. In this step also write all the major problems because in life there's a lot of problems, all right? So in this step, just write all the major big, big, big problems that they would face. And to keep it simple for you guys, just write one problem for one desire, for one goal, for one result, for each and every one of them. Keep it simple. Step four, write a list of micro problems. This is where you go deeper into the problems that they would face because all the major problems that we mentioned in step three, even more problems are going to arise when they face them. So I call this micro problems. All you got to do here is list a few micro problems under the major problem that you listed before. By now, you should have lots of ideas for your products, your services or your content. Also, I like to cross out all of the problems that aren't related to my business or content and you can do it too. Step five, write a list of solutions. In this step, you create an entire list of solutions for every problem and micro problem. This is probably the hardest step, but as long as you stay relevant to your content or your business, you will come up with plenty of solutions and ideas. 
To help you understand this, let's use the six pack example, okay? If I wanted a six pack and I'm having trouble with eating too many snacks, then one of your solutions, if you were a business, for example, would be a blueprint for a diet plan or a schedule that I have to follow. Or if you created content, then your solution would be like a 20 minute YouTube video of how to stay on track with your diet or how to stop eating too many snacks. By now, you should have two full lists of problems and solutions. And voila, you have plenty of ideas for your content or your business. And usually that's where I stop. But there's also an additional step that's optional for those who are in a really broad niche. For example, if you're in the gym niche, there are a lot of problems and solutions in that niche, right? It's very broad. So the extra step you can take is write multiple dream avatars. This step allows you to have more avatars, which allows you to have more problems, more solutions to write, which brings you more content and enhance your product or service. Now that you know how to create a dream avatar, here are some really important tips that you need to know before you start writing. If you want to take anything away from this video, just remember this. A dream avatar is all about knowing your target. Remember to not stem away from whatever you're trying to achieve. If you are running a business or you're creating content for a specific target audience or market, you're going to have to make an avatar that relates to you in some way. How do you help your avatar? How does your content get your avatar closer to their dream outcome? How does your product and service get your dream avatar to their outcome? You need to ask these questions every day and write. Writing is the key to creating solutions. It is the foundation of all content and businesses. And if you really hate writing and you struggle with getting ideas and being creative, watch this video next. I'm Kentor. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.